stars. They're just like us. So, of course, they will be on hand to pay respects to Her Majesty the Queen. Already there have been reports of stars like David Beckham, Sharon Osbourne, and Tilda Swinton joining the miles-long queue to see the monarch lying in state. But among the guest list, there features one unexpected actor. Keep watching to find out whom. Amongst the many famous faces who will be attending the funeral of Queen Elizabeth II on September 19th is the actor Sandra Oh. In an announcement posted to Canada's website, Prime Minister Justin Trudeau shared he and his wife, Sophie Gregoire Trudeau, would be attending the funeral, along with several other delegates from Canada. As a member of the Order of Canada, O is included in the delegation, and will walk, quote, in a procession of recipients of national honors as part of the service. The website notes the Order of Canada was established by Queen Elizabeth II in 1967 to recognize those who have demonstrated outstanding service to the nation. CTV News shared O's honor was bestowed this past June. O has received 13 Emmy nominations. Four of those nominations were for Outstanding Lead Actress in a Drama Series for her role as Eve Pilastri in the BBC America series Killing Eve. She also received five nominations for Outstanding Supporting Actress in a Drama Series for her role as Dr. Christina Yang in Grey's Anatomy. Before landing in America, O attended the National Theatre School in Canada and began acting in Canadian projects. She told Vogue, In Canada, there is a mandate for diversity. I was a girl, Asian, and I spoke French. I ticked all their boxes. She added, I took it with the correct outlook, which is to gain as much experience as I could. While Grey's Anatomy alum Sandra Oh will be in attendance at Queen Elizabeth's funeral on behalf of Canada, the commemoration of the late monarch's life is sure to be a star-studded event. As noted by iNews, celebrities such as environmental narrator and broadcaster Sir David Attenborough, composer Lord Andrew Lloyd Webber, and race car driver Sir Jackie Stewart are expected to be among those mourning the Queen at Westminster Abbey. Onlookers may also expect to see the likes of Daniel Craig, Gary Barlow, Sir Elton John, and Dame Helen Mirren in attendance. Of course, these figures aren't a random assortment of celebrity mourners, but rather high-profile stars who shared personal connections to the Queen. David Attenborough, for instance, shared a touching relationship with Queen Elizabeth II. And a video of the two walking the grounds of Buckingham Palace together has even resurfaced amid the monarch's death. Stuart, meanwhile, was supposed to visit the Queen at Balmoral on September 14th, six days after she died. Of the late rulers, Stuart is said to be, quote, distraught due to her passing. In addition to Sandra O, oh, the royal family, dignitaries, and politicians, and likely other high-profile celebrities, mourners of Queen Elizabeth II can tune into her funeral proceedings on September 19th. As detailed by People, news networks including NBC, Fox News, CNN, and ABC are expected to air the funeral. In Britain, networks Sky News, BBC One, and BBC News are showing the day's ongoings. Queen Elizabeth II's funeral is slated to start at 11 a.m. local time, which translates to 6 a.m. Eastern and 3 a.m. Pacific for our West Coast royal watchers. If cable news is not accessible, the BBC is expected to livestream the event online. As for the United Kingdom in this period of grief, Fortune has noted that daily life for Britons has all but come to a halt as non-urgent medical appointments, flights, and school classes have been canceled. 